Hello, and thanks for checking out ChartGuys.com. We're proud to be one of the most successful technical analysis communities online, teaching you the skills to become a more confident, effective, and informed trader. Join our community of hundreds of analysts worldwide working together to learn the charts, generate profit, and achieve financial independence. Sign up for a one-week free trial, no credit card required, for access to daily live chart analysis and market coverage, a thriving chat community, along with dozens of hours of exclusive educational materials. We look forward to seeing you. Let's check out some charts. Hey guys, it's James the Chart Guys. It is Thursday, this, uh, January 4th. I'm going to do my nightly video on uh, natural gas. So natural gas, I pointed out last night, we were in a range here. We're in tightening range. And... Um, I highlighted the the support to look at this morning would be at 2.959 in the chat room. And once we broke that, um, you can see that bears actually took over at an increasing bear volume from the previous candle here. Uh, and bears are in control here on this hourly chart and potentially forming a bear flag here. Looking at the daily, I'm going to change to contracts. So the daily has an inside candle bear break on increasing bear volume. So the next support, what I would watch tomorrow is uh, the low of today of 2.84. If we break 2.84, then look for further pullback um, from today's lows. So 2.84 is going to be the key support I'd watch tomorrow. Key resistance for me here. Well, there's going to be a lot of resistance here. Um, I'm going to watch the previous support here first as our first resistance. Uh, that's going to be actually, yeah, I want to look at this candle here at 2.92, then 2.923, uh, 2.959, and then 2.972. Those are going to be my resistances tomorrow if there is any momentum for the bulls. Other than that, just looking for an oversold hourly RSI bounce with the RSI being under 30. Weekly. Contract changes, uh, still setting lower highs on the weekly. So you can see that we are rejecting right under the 20 MA here, which is at 3.109 and beginning to pull back already. So weekly chart has a lot, uh, a lot, of, a lot of room for, for bulls to make up before they change the trend here on the weekly for NAT gas. And I know that people continue to look at weather reports and things like that to trade NAT gas. But uh, from my past experience, weather is not a good indicator for which direction NAT gas is going to go. I've seen plenty of winters where NAT gas has dropped during the winter. Uh, so I do not believe in uh, using weather as an indicator, maybe for a very short term trade. But if you're looking at days or weeks, I don't trust winter as being a good time to be in NAT gas just because of the season and it being cold. But anyways, have a good night and I'll see you tomorrow.